what's up guys it's your girl tiffy styles back at you again with another video i know it's been about you know three weeks since i've done a video guys i'm in grad school and this work is getting crazy so I've been on my A game with grad school and I took a little break from doing videos but I'm back and today's video I am going to do a flexi rod set. So I saw one of my friends, her name is Stitch by Sophie on YouTube so go ahead and check out her YouTube page she has tons of hair content and her videos are super dope. So we're just going to start right off with this video. My hair is freshly washed and as I've stated in my previous videos, I use Africa's Pride leave-in conditioner and moisturizing lotion. But I just only put the leave-in conditioner because the moisturizing lotion is a little bit thicker and I don't want to put too much product on my hair for this flexi rod set. It is my first time doing it so I am super super nervous all right so we're just gonna start right off and i'm gonna section my hair into four so i'm going to start from the back so we're definitely not gonna put a clip in that section are you guys ready because i don't know we're gonna just try to do this together okay by the way i am going to be using mousse on my hair i found this mousse at family dollar called white rain volumizing mousse i was trying to look for the popular ones but i couldn't find any popular well-known brands so i just bought this it was like a dollar and 50 cents i mean it's smooth so i'm hoping that it does the same thing <laughs> but let's just jump right into attempting this flexi rod set Comment below and tell me if I'm doing it right because I saw um, I think my friend started from the end of the flexi rod and rolled up and I think I'm starting from the middle I don't know yeah I don't know what do you guys think that I create content that I attempt for the first time and you guys try right along with me. I love this entire journey so that I can look back at my videos and see how far I've come. I'm sure I'll get better at doing this once I keep practicing. I am like laughing because this is so hard for me like it oh my goodness <sighs> I'm just gonna finish the other side and be right back with you guys the thing is my hair is super kinky so when it comes time for me to actually wrap it around it's not it's so hard for me to get it to be smooth so that's my struggle right now but I'm not gonna knock it. We shall see how this turns out. By the way, 
way, I started to use a comb to detangle because sometimes when I use a Denman brush, it pulls on my hair and I'm really uncomfortable with that. So I decided to use a comb instead. Time to unravel my hair. I am so nervous. I think it's dry. I actually blow dried it for about 20 minutes because I wasn't with the whole air drying thing. I normally air dry, but uh, I was a bit lazy today. So yeah, let's see how it comes out. I'm excited. <laughs> First of all that definitely wasn't it i had to separate that um that section and do two different flexi rods because the other one was way too big a lot in all of my videos where I'm trying a new hairstyle I am really trying not to separate my hair too much I do not want to take away the definition of these curls and that is definitely my problem when it comes to trying new hairstyles but I think I'm doing pretty pretty good so far be back when I'm like completely done guys I'm still just gonna separate a little bit more and then come back with the finished touch oh my gosh guys I am so happy with the results like can you guys see this I mean clearly you can see this you're watching my video but like look at it it's so pretty I honestly thought it was gonna turn out a hot hot mess especially after what just happened yeah but I am so glad with the results. I like that, you know, it's defined. I did not separate it way too much where it lost its definition. I mean, of course, the more I do this, the more I would completely get better at doing a flexi rod set. But I'm happy. Tell me what you guys think. If you like it, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel and press that notification bell so you can know when I drop a new video to all of my new subscribers i appreciate you and to those who've been rocking with me from day one i love you guys have a wonderful and blessed day bye <laughs>